Is this it? Is this the big one? We need this. Well, it looks like it's someone who was born in the late 19th century. I'd say there's a 40% chance of it being him. That's a very sciencey way of saying I probably won't get what I want. Maybe. Uh, here. Those are for you. Pick one and memorize it. You're giving me a catchphrase? Catchy phrases. When you say catchphrase, it sounds dumb, so don't say that. I'm not an actor. You're not an actor. You're an employee. You're a piece of equipment, like everything else here that I own. And you are contractually obligated to do what I say, and I let you get away with a lot. I invented time travel for you. You also invented rubbing that in my face. Initiating you have seen your Okay, so far, so not what I wanted. Hello, sir, what is your name? I am Sigmund Freud. Normally, in my nakedness, my mother would cover me in a blanket. Oh, this is gonna be great. What a boring episode, unless someone does their job. I'm not gonna read that. Read your catchphrase, Urkel. Do you want me to leave? No. I want you to stay. And you owe history an episode. Welcome to my world. Good luck doing a show without me. You're gonna find out it's not that easy. Who was that Alpha Ben? He's the host. This is a TV show. It's called Great Minds. Who are you? I'm the time travel guy. I bring historical figures through so he can talk to them. OK. Well, tonight on Great Minds, Sigmund Freud, the founder of psychoanalysis, and, and what's your name? Spencer. Spencer. Cool name. Has anyone ever told you you look just like Charlie Chaplin? Oh my god, can you do the waddle? Do the waddle. Do it.